So I just got these um, extra pads, I mean, or rather cheek riser pads for my Ruger Hunter. And you see I ended up uh, putting the medium size, like this is what was on the rifle from the plant, from the factory. And I wanted to go with this one, but then I discovered that with this one on, I cannot put the bolt in. Or I can put the bolt in and then put this on, but then each time I have to remove the bolt, I would have to play with the screw over here and disconnect this, you know, every time, which seemed like not a very good idea since this is just one bolt sitting inside a plastic, so probably would wear out. And so I ended up just putting the medium size cheek rise, so now I can actually install. Actually, let me show you this. I can install the the bolt with very tight tolerances and the, the handle has to be this way but you see I'm putting my finger here so I don't want to scratch the top but if I put it like this you see boom then it goes this way and I push this button over here which is a bit tight And then I can, like there's a couple of millimeters clearance over here. So, um, so I decided to go for this one, even though um, for my eye relief, it would better to go with this. But then I, I thought, wait a second, I have this. It's the same Macpool stock, right? So maybe I can, and of course this one, that's what it came with from the factory when I got this Macpool stock uh, upgrade for the shotgun that originally came with just a regular Mossberg stock. But this one is definitely better, but it's still, if you can see, if it, look at the cheek rise, it's the low version, right? But now I have this and I have this, which is, uh, I don't know, maybe it should work, right? The only problem is that the color like over here it's black over there it's gray but you know who's counting right and so i get my screwdriver over here so let's see if it will fit so the cheek riser kit i got for my macpool Mm. Aruba Hunter let's see if it will fit Macpool on, on a shotgun so I take one bolt just move slightly the, the pads then this comes off and then I already tried the big one the big one was too big so I decided to go for this medium size I mean small size actually yeah that's the the one that came with my uh, Ruger Hunter from the factory and it goes in perfectly just the color looks a bit weird There you go. So now I have effectively upgraded the Macpool stock on my shotgun. So, so this is before and this is after. And as I can see now, it's much better for me, you know, because I, I shoot with the left eye dominant. It's much, it feels, holding the, the shotgun feels much easier this way with this taller piece than with this. So I think I'm going to keep it. 
even though it looks a bit funny with the gray but like this and this is already gray so I don't know you guys let me know what you think but this is definitely uh, a, just for me it's more economical uh, cheek rise uh, than this thanks for watching